DC Mayor Vincent Gray and the city's water director are breaking ground this morning. Yeah, this is a project that could spell relief for a couple of flood prone Northwest neighborhoods and our Jeanette Reyes is live in Northwest this morning with the details. Jeanette. Well, Jumi, no one is looking forward to this more than the residents here. This groundbreaking is highly anticipated for them because they've been dealing with major flooding here for quite some time, specifically the Bloomingdale neighborhood. During heavy rain, Rhode Island Avenue was often turned into a raging river with raw sewage seeping into many of the homes. But this morning, DC Water, along with Mayor Vincent Gray, will break ground on the First Street Tunnel, a critical step to alleviate flooding in the Bloomingdale neighborhood. Now, this will add about 3 million gallons of water storage and it's part of a major flood prevention project. It's about it's about one hundred and forty five million dollars and it's set to be completed in twenty twenty two. Now you can see behind me this road is closed off. It's one of several that will be closed off for the next two to three years and in the time that we've been here as early as it is this road is pretty busy. Some of the residents here have complained about that inconvenience but many say it's a it's not a bad price to pay to finally resolve this issue and uh, hopefully stop the roads and those homes from flooding so often every single time it rains. Reporting live in Northwest, Jeanette Reyes, ABC 7 News.